Hey guys, it is DGD, the old gamer Dill, and welcome back to another part of this fairy tale PS4 Let's Play series. Alright, so in the last part, we did a lot of character quests as well as job requests, and in this part, I'm gonna do one more quest because they're like really fun, and then I think we will be able to continue with the story. Alright, let's do a quest with Natsu and Lucy. Well, wait. Actually, let's do a quest with these three instead. With uh, Wendy, Urza, and Juvia. <laughs> Stealing laundry from young women for this collect for his collection we'll have to beat some decency into this man we w don't necessarily know that the culprit is a man if gray really wanted mine I wouldn't mind yeah okay okay Juvia <laughs> we know you wouldn't mind sorry Juvia gray doesn't care for worn clothes he's only interested in stripping out of his own how could this be this conversation has really taken a turn. Yeah, like, do we have to have this conversation in front of Wendy? She's so pure and innocent. Anyway, we all live in the dorms, so let's go back to Fairy Hills and plan what we're gonna do. Yes. First, back to the dorm for a strategy meeting. Let's go to Fairy Hills. Yes. We'll need a decoy if we're going. If wait, wait, wait. We'll need a decoy if we're to catch the laundry lunatic. So, I've brought some of my own things. You wear those? <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> Why do you seem so proud of that? <laughs> I brought this too. Oh. My, how wonderful and womanly. Okay, hero. Now, if this was in the anime, we would see everything, most likely. <laughs> most likely. You brought something too, Juvia? Yes? Now it's your turn, Wendy. Okay, now this is becoming weird. <sighs> uh, me too? Oh no. Here. Hmm. Simple yet elegant. For women of culture. She's just a little girl! <laughs> I don't need your comments. Yes. Let's hang these. You're gonna snip you're gonna attract them with your you're gonna attract the perv with your scent? Your underwear scent? I mean A monster is coming. Huh, the monsters, there are monsters everywhere. And they took the underwear, didn't they? Mm. It snatched mine and Juvia's garments and ran off. Uh. Then it must be the culprit. Let's go after them. Alright. Uh... So they, so the monster just got by without the magic council even noticing them. I saw a strange bird fly towards that rundown bar east of here. I wonder what kind of bird that was. Oh, it was a monster, the monster kind of bird. Oh wait, fast travel. You perverted bird. Ah, we don't have to go all out.
Besides, we got Juvia and Urza. The queen of the fairies herself. There's got to be more somewhere. Keep looking. Let's go over to... The cathedral. Holy cow, there's a monster on top of the cathedral. Nice. That's all of them. Now no one should have no now no one should have any more problems with their laundry getting stolen. There's a nest here. My clothes. Let's see. Ah. Mine are here as well. Most of them most of the victims' clothes should be here. Everything is all fancy and showy. There are spoons and coins too. They must have been collecting shiny things. So that's why my words. So that's why mine weren't stolen. Wendy. What's wrong, Wendy? Eh? Nothing, nothing at all. Whoa. The clothes are safe and sound. Time to report back. <laughs> Just burbs. That's all you gotta say. Just burbs. Nice. All right, guys. Uh, yeah, we're not ready to rank up. Not even, not even close. Um, yeah. So with that being said, we got a whole buttload of cash, and our team is looking pretty good. So let's continue with the story. Second. All right. Good. Looks like you've gotten strong enough. All right. Oh, right. By the way, you got a letter from Jalal. He's in the Great Plains. Show him what you've learned. All right. So we gotta guess. I guess just go fight Jalal now. It's a mood. It's a mood. But not really at the same time. Anyway. Hey, Jalal. Hey, Mer uh, Old Tear. ね。修行の成果見せてもらうよ。準備はいいかしら。こちらは本気でいかせてもらう。俺たちに勝てなければ。大魔頭演武でも勝ち抜けまい。オッケー。オー、そうです。This is a boss fight. They are not just some ragtag guilds. Oh my. Oh, Awakening 2. If you are attacked when your Awakening Gauge is maxed out, you will be able to respond by respond to the attack by Awakening. By Awakening. Press the up button. It, press the button when up is displayed during the enemy's attack sequence, and you will be immune to enemy attacks while you are, while you awaken. However, this will cause Awakening to be two turns shorter than usual. See. Okay. Um, let's use ice make. 
Let's use Ice Make Floor. Oh, ult here resists it. Okay, let's use Ice Make Excalibur on... You know what, no. How about this? We'll use Ice Make Rampart on everybody. And then... I'm gonna save the next, you know, boost for um, Natsu. I would summon Aquarius, but I feel like I should probably use... I'm gonna use Hor summon Horologium on Lucy. Then with Urza... Honestly, Ur this is more so Urza's fight. Because she's like really strong. Alright, let's use Trinity Sword on both of them. Then let's use Fire Dragon Brilliant Flame. Nice. Flash forward. Alright, so let's use Summon Lyra and heal everybody. Imagine if Lyra actually did that. Shoot, they that could have busted them out of so many things. Nice. Let's awaken with the Fire Dragon Lightning mode. Imagine Lucy kick <laughs> took out um Jalal man. That would be something. Let's make use ice make floor. Ice make Time for the ultimate attack. Bye, Jalal. How did that? I was about to say, how did that not take him out? The guilty sense. Whenever needed. I'll show you what we're made of. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, so we're not done yet. Oh my goodness. Okay, so you know what? Uh, let's use Panagram Sword on both of them. We're gonna have to heal. Okay. Let's use Lightning Fire Dragon Hammer. Actually, yeah, let's use this one. Let's use this one. 
Jesus, Natsu, just knock them into the sun. May the seven stars bring judgment upon you. Oh, good God. Nope, nope, it's not. Well, he's not doing it. Ow. Ah, we can watch the animation. Because he was going to use Grand Chariot. I was like, nope, nope, no you ain't. Jesus Christ, Jalal. I thought this was just a sparring match. Sema? Oh no. Try and stop me before I finish counting. What? Okay, this 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 is not training anymore. They're, they're really fighting now. Okay, uh I don't know what to do. You know what? Let's do let's go let's go for Aquarius summon again. At this point, point, I'm just gonna use everyone's strongest attacks. Let's use Ice Bringer. And then let's finish everything off with Urza. Ah, shoot. Let's just let's finish it off with Lucy Kick. <laughs> nice. Everyone leveled up too. Yes, she got Leo summoned. My girl. That fight was actually kind of intense. That was sparring. これなら心配なさそうだ。心置きなく大魔党演武じゃ。
Okay, Meredy, thanks. Yeah, cause you definitely stick out when you got blue and pink hair. Stick out like a sword. Actually, you wouldn't really stick out in anime. You wouldn't really stick out. In the real world, yeah, you would. Nice. Uh, I'm I'm so tired. Training is finally over. Let's get back to the guild and rest up until the games. So now we're at chapter three, the Grand Magic Games. Hmm. I know we're all pretty excited, but does anyone even know where the Grand Magic Games are being held? Oh. You don't know? Uh. And you do? Ah. Nope. <laughs> I knew it. Uh, the games are being held in the capital, Crocus. Ah. Good. It should be an easy way it should be an easy trip along the capital highway you say easy but my body still hurts all over from the second origin I'm kind of worried what a weakling oh that's right Lucy that's yeah yeah that's right don't call her weak yes Now, let's make for Cro Crocus. Don't mean to be a fanboy, it's just... My girl is not weak. Yes. She is one of the strongest. But anyway, enough fangirling. Uh, episode 1 of Chapter 3 training's over, and the Grand Magic Games begin tomorrow. Leave Magnolia and head for the venue in Crocus. Can we still enter the guild, or...? Okay, so we can still take job... Okay, no we cannot. No, we cannot. I feel like I should stock up on, like, so many items right now. So, let's go ahead and do that, actually. Let's get a whole buttload of salves. Let's get a whole buttload of ether nanos. Let's get some... Revival re remedies. More burn ointments. Nice. Alright, now I'm ready. Yes. Huh. Hey. Well, guys, let's go ahead and do this. Now, the Grand Magic Games is probably one of the more controversial arcs because of how it ended, and a lot of people really blamed it on the power of friendship. Honestly, the way I see it, in the beginning, it actually started off alright. It's just. I think a lot of people really have to understand 
yes, the power of friendship really did kind of ruin it. However, you have to understand that there are certain characters that were kind of overhyped to be strong but weren't actually supposed to be that strong like for example I don't think Sting was ever really that strong I think it's because Natsu and Gajio and Wendy for that matter weren't there that they were able to make a name for themselves and so people viewed them as the really you know what this is probably about to be a cutscene so let me shut up um let's just wait and see I'm gonna keep saying what I'm about to say but let me just wait Crocus is this way, huh? There are monsters about. Be careful. Capital Highway. But yeah. So, like, I don't think Sting was ever made out to be this overly strong dude. I think he just boost, boasted himself up because Crocus was really the only guild around. Because Fairy Tail was on top. Fairy Tail was probably the best guild in Fiore. And then when they. And when most there went most of their strongest wizards disappeared of course they fell straight to the bottom because all the other wizards are kind of just supporting they're just that they're just supporting characters all right I have a favor I'd like to ask you ah we have that yeah don't forget to do some of the community requests they're actually pretty rewarding got an igneous rock but yeah, it's like, you know, I don't think, like, wizards like Sting and Rogue, like, yeah, they're strong, no doubt about it. However, I don't think they were never, ever supposed to be, like, so strong to where, oh, beware of Sting and Rogue, you know, they'll give you a run for your money because they're so strong and powerful, no. It's more so because Natsu and Gajio weren't there that they were able to climb to that, um, to that, to that height. When in reality, it wasn't even like that. It was nothing like that. Ooh, this guy's level 18. I think, I think we'll be fine. Uh, let's use Horologium Summon. This is where we gotta kind of start playing more strategically. Ah, we don't have Wendy for healing. Uh. Oh, we don't have a paralysis heal. Oh shoot. Now it's fearful. That's right. Yes. Oh wait, that's burn. I thought it was paralysis. I'm so stupid. Nice. And now Gray got Ice Make Hammer Evolve. Nice, nice. But yeah, like. Sting was never really made out to be well okay yeah he was but not from the sense of oh he's probably one of the strongest characters in the overall series one of the strongest dragon slayers in the overall um series no he wasn't he was not at all and neither was um uh Minerva I mean Minerva had a very strong type of magic because it's spatial magic and spatial magic is pretty um overpowered to begin with but it's not the strongest form i mean it's not she wasn't one of the strongest compared to urza because she played dirty half the time so yeah Let's 
Sadly. Ice Maker! Ice Bringer! Just trying to train as I go. But yeah, I mean, that's how I like to, how I would like to view, um, let's customize the team. Let's switch gray, ah, shoot. Ah, we'll be fine. Like I said, that's how, like, how, that's how I like to think of it. I mean, it's the same thing for Rogue. Because he got bodied twice by, um, uh, Gajil. I mean, bodied. To the point where it's like, gee, and the thing is, Gajil didn't even have second origin. Or at least, I would like to believe he didn't even have second origin. Natsu has the uh, second origin and okay yeah we can talk about power friendship but and the fact that Natsu is part demon because you know he literally comes from the book of END well it's complicated let's just say it's because of Zerif why Natsu is honestly so strong I'm just kind of getting some training in so I'll be kind of ready for the Grand Magic game. I want to at least try to get to level 20. Uh, let's use... Let's use Leo Summon. No, no, not... Nah, that's not even worth it. I don't know. Because, I mean, a lot of people like to argue that, you know, Second Origin was kind of cheap. And I would argue. I mean, I thought Second Origin was like this. I mean, in a way, it was cheap. But because we like to believe that, okay, they could, they really could have done the training. However, I thought, you know, it made a little bit of sense. I mean, they got to have some other way to boost their magic. Any way at all. Because, I mean, there's magic all around their world. Their magic is basically, their magic comes from the Ether Nano. So I guess we can think about Second Origin as just being raw Ether Nano that wizards can use in order to get stronger. If it makes any sense at all. Nice. Yes, 
者一个。Let's use Fire Dragon Wing Attack. We got Trinity Sword 2. Nice. Alright, uh, we're still good. He got Mega Fire Dragon Roar. Excellent. We got some delicious candy. Speaking of which, let's go over to um, Magnolia and see if we can give some to Plu. The boy Plu. But yeah, so overall, the Magic, the Grand Magic Games arc. Now listen. I had some salty moments. I thought Flair versus Lucy, Lucy had that win. I was so mad at Raventail for that moment because my girl gets so much hate and she was shining literally that whole battle. <laughs> like I said, she did everything right that whole bot battle. She was literally. I mean, literally. Almost. I mean, she literally almost swept her. The only reason why um, Flair got any hits in was because of the fact that she cheated. And the thing is, Raventail cheated twice that fight. So, and no one called it. And the second time was when she tried to catch cast Uranometria, but it failed because um, their member decided to be a jerk and cancel the spell out. I mean, Raventail was literally made to just be the troll of that whole entire arc in the beginning, to be like the main villains of the arc. And then we, then Sabretooth kinda acted like villains, but at the same time, it was more so because they had 
Sting and Rogue acting like, well, mainly Sting acting like complete, acting like a complete jerk throughout the entirety of the Grand Magic games. Uh, there was just a lot going on with that arc. Because then Minerva just came and she was just, oh. A mess. Not a mess, like in a bad way, but just like a mess in terms of everything that she did from beating up Lucy to then torturing Miliana, uh, Gray's friend. Uh, not, not Gray. Uh, Urza's friend and I'm over here just like geez can we whatever happened to just playing fair <laughs> and they really and then hero really hyped her up to be basically a villain but then Tartarus came and she was more so just the victim of abuse brought on by her father and of course, so that made her out to be the person that she was. So basically a jerk. Who was only obsessed with being strong. Nice. Jesus. Alright guys, we are almost at level 20 for the other guys, for the other people within our team. Alright, nice. Okay, and with that being said, we come to the end of yet another part to this fairy tale Let's Play series. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like, you can follow my Instagram and Twitter, as well as like this video and subscribe to my channel for more content. It's been a pleasure playing, and I will see you guys in the next part. DGD, out.